No jumping in FPS. You'd have to rebind all your controls for like a day. Um, like macro control V over copying a singular space in a text document. <clears throat> now, did you do this natively, or do I have to load a state? Dog, I cool to water. Space is jump or no jump. You know what? Fair. Oh. Did it proper save? Did we actually get a proper save out of a video game on bizhawk.com? It looks that way. And then I still have the pig guy, so you know what, we're good. What are you doing here? Okay, okay so you're gonna have all of your equipment taken away from you anyway. Hooray for SRAM. Hooray for BizHawk SRAM actually working. Anyway, gun! I would like a third version of this. Uh, Dragon apparently doesn't matter. I did a little bit of research into Monstars. I'm not going to be able to find a Behemoth or Tiamat until Chapter 4. <clears throat> so this is like going to be my party, more or less, with Verb here on the side. Um, as far as I could tell, nothing really does faith-based abilities that I need to worry about right now. Maybe the Hydra Hydra, Hydra do that, but like... So yeah, once we enter Gaug, upon entering Gaug Machine City, several cutscenes will play in sequence. It is recommended that you set aside the rest of the chapter because, lol, you're not getting back this way for till chapter three. Um, I think we'll still have access to the monastery. Okay, you're 14, you're 13, you're 11, which is bad. And you are 13, which is okay. Higher levels than I had going into Execution Site the first time I tried to do this challenge. But I honestly think probably I want to grind a little bit. So we're going to start off with like a little bit of that till people roll in and whatnot. But yes, hi. Hi, hello. It is Saturday time zone time. I realize also I'm streaming against SGD Cube, which is not ideal. <laughs> but hey, it is what it is. And my cat won't stop screaming at me for attention for some reason. So, that's always fun. Anyway, yeah, Tic Tacs. I kind of would like everybody to be in the 15 range before I go to Execution Site. Just because it's Execution Site and it's going to be that way. Wow, did I stumble into a random pincer attack? What is going on? You're weak against water, not ice, right? Water weakness, yeah. You don't have an ice weakness. This feels safer overall. Looking at two cars, a 2014 and 2017 Chevrolet Equinox. Not a fan of the 2014s only because it's simple as you can get, but it's cheaper, prefer quality of life features, father prefers most basic vehicles, cause clashing. Yeah. 
Here's a major question. Are you going to be learning to drive in this vehicle? Yes, okay. Is this a car for you or your father? Both, okay. Family car. I mean, I'm leaning the 17 anyway. Not that I know, like, heck all about cars, but... Like, I know literally nothing about cars except that they go. But outside of that, yeah, no, nothing. Um, you don't drive, neither do I. I need to learn eventually, though. So, um, I did get a little bit of reassurance, though, that I, uh, a friend of my mother's who's a cab driver does it for a living, um, personally didn't learn how to drive until they were, like, 40 and drive a cab for a living, so, um, that in and of itself is reassuring. Can I shoot anything else cleanly? You, surprisingly. Also, a personal taste, but every car your family owned was silver and tan. The 2014 is silver and it's getting sick of silver cars. It's personal preference. You can deal with that. Yeah. Cars can get painted eventually. That costs money, but, they, they, but it can be done. Wave around! Pop up. Pop up. Oh, they both can count. Okay. I did, I've never tested that before. That's why I didn't think that AoEs could be countered. Hey, you miss pal. Uh, yeah, okay, you're not. You're not. Experience points. Even Anto has been trying to get her driver's license, always fails in the driving portion. His 58 has been trying almost every year for the license since she is 25. Oh, okay. You're fine on the XP, I can play a little safe. Okay, you can't hit me, which is nice. Be quiet. I do That's, that's a kill, that's a kill. And I don't think I can hit any of you. Yeah. <clears throat> oh right, I can take this opportunity to tell my bird about the, the glorious website of Reddit. Now just don't counter and we're in business. But you're gonna counter because you're right inside. Uh oh, you're doing a thing. Oh, wait, never mind. No. That's just oil, that's not sleep. Never mind. It's okay. Crisis averted. It was countered though, and I didn't want that. Cause you're the one that needs the XP. Okay, that missed, but it didn't matter. And that missed, but it didn't matter. You do it.
Give it up for status conditions. Give it up for status effects. On a character I need to not be status effect. Give it up. Class act, 10 out of 10. Never gets old. Anyway, perish. More like, am I right, chat? I mean, right on that Wilhelm screen. How's it going, Mint? Hello, hello. Anyway, perish. Misha, what is up? Hi, hello. Don't perish, Misha. How are you doing? I hope you're doing well today. Doing okay, tired out? I feel that. Minotaurus level up animation, yeah. Wilhelm scream was timed perfectly of watching a fail without accomplish a guy falling on the street top nice. Elbow boogie, yeah. Okay, didn't move at all. I need the dragon to move though, is the problem. Better idea. They're not gonna move, I can do this all day. Not that a dragon doesn't need levels also, but like... Here's a free action. Okay, you should do like no damage now. And in fact, one more and you turn into a chicken, which is hilarious. Oh, you can't get that. The Chocobo has to get that. Okay. No. no, you are literally just stuck. How did I get a Minotaur S over there then? That's like a really good question. Yeah, 5% miss. I'm not going to play the boo over it, but, you know, that 5% miss. I'll take a poison in every chip up here as a free action. It's only an ether, though. Ox. Ghost. 
okay, you're going for a throw. That's fine. Goody start a I have to go for it, it's EXP. You do need the XP also, so I may as well. Now, do I care enough about that crystal to make Ramza go after it? Probably. Soft. Don't you do it. Oh, throw spear. Okay, carry on. Carry on my wayward spirit. Yeah, you need the XP. And I don't see a way back for the Minotaur anyway, so... I'm sure whatever time magics you knew would be very interesting for Ramzadin to learn, but... Risking a sleep. I'm only 14 EXP that time. Despite it being a kill. Okay, this is a messy spot to grind in for what should be a number of obvious reasons. I don't want to go to Gaug yet though, because like I'm gonna be locked into execution site by then. How bad is stuff here? Guess we don't know. Did I get any mon stars? I got an egg. Shame I didn't get any new monsters though. Anyway, yeah, happy Saturday time zone. I hope everyone's having a good weekend. Oh, really? X, what is up? Hi, hello. How are you? Hope you're doing well today. Okay, what have you hatched into? A dragon. That's nice. I actually don't need a dragon. A red one would be nice, but actually a blue one is just as fine. Like, apparently, red dragons are slightly better offensively, but so many things in this game are weak to ice that a blue dragon is still pretty okay. And look at these stats. I mean, I had to raise, you know, manipulate faith to this degree, but... I think for me to replace the red chocobo I currently have would have to be, like, the best red chocobo ever of all time, really. Replace by that, I mean rename. I've done that a few times already. There were chocobos that were just like slightly higher level and had better stats, so I just renamed Blabadil. I think we're on like Blabadil 3. <laughs> also, how's it going, Blab? Hope you're doing well today.
fucking back. Any dragon is a good dragon, that's true. But the blue and red ones have a ranged attack, and the green ones don't without being next to Ramza. The dragons are fast, let me tell you. Are you weak to ice or resisted? I forget how bombs work in this game. I absorb ice half, okay. Doing, just got home from work, nice. Hop. Oh, flap. Go burbs! I don't care that I'm fighting them. Go burbs! I thought Ramza had better jump than that, and I miscalculated a lot of things. Here's a big brain play. I'm gonna wait for the counters and then, like, kill them and run. Okay, that was a one shot. That was kind of a mistake. Gotta say, you picked up the wrong bird. Yeah, Balt is a little bit more here. You, I need to hit the counter. You did not counter. What a mess. What a mess this battle is. I need to get Rams over there to revive that bomb so that uh, it can be one shot. Peck, peck. Okay, can we have the camera somewhere I like? That would be appreciated. My luck is very poor this battle. Oh, okay, there we go. St two, two 70s effective 70% 70 chances failed. I'd still like you to hit your counter before I take the shot. Say goodbye to one of you. And of course, you're gonna try and just pick off the chocobo because. Oh, wait, you're not? Okay. I need to survive because it's way more use for me to do that.
Why are you not attacking? Hello? Why am I not countering anything? Hello? I, all of all of them are at like around 70 brave. How am I missing this many 70s in a row consecutively? There we go. Big counters. Cappuccino! At Cappuccino, thank you so much for the raid. Friends of the Red Maid's Village, we are under attack. Welcome in everybody from at Cappuccino Stream. My name is Dove, pronouns they, she. Um, I am primarily a retro RPG challenge run enthusiast, most of the of classic Final Fantasy. But uh, I am also a red mage in the truest sense of the word. Also a bird, but that's not relevant. Um, I do a little bit of everything from shufflers to randomizers, and if I'm feeling fancy, I will take some CPUs, lock them in a basement, make them play Monopoly. If that floats your boat, feel free to hit the follow button, stick around. I got anonymous follows on. If you got a raid and run, I totally get it, because streaming is a lot. Uh, also, food and everything is also super important. Um, but yeah, how's it going? Cappuccino. I, I, I would ask what you were doing, but I know what you were doing because I was there like an hour ago. So, Do I own the Misty Asuku? Possibly? I'd have to check. I feel like you've asked me this before and I feel like that's exactly what I said last time. I'd have to look. I think so. I want to say I do. But yes, welcome. Welcome. Tierno and welcome, plus you. I hope everyone is having a good day. If you're not already on my end, go give Tierno a follow. Tierno is a cute plushie who does a lot of video games uh, like TF2 and was playing the um, Misty Iyazaki game, which is like super mega great. Actually, I had never seen any footage of the game before that. But as for me right now, I am playing Final Fantasy Tactics. I do challenge runs Thursday, sometimes Friday, and always Saturday. Uh, this one is the Final Fantasy Tactics Monster Party Challenge. Rules are up there on the right. Also, exclamation mark challenge if you just want to see a written list of the rules. Basically, I can only play with monsters. Uh, it is actually a pretty good fun menagerie kind of time. Yeah, come on. No, you'll you'll act next, so. This is a risk, but I'm gonna take it anyway. There we go. No more pot shots. What does Beacon do? Lower physical attack? Anyway, bird. So this this is the start of what I like to call the Red Mage Village Summer Festival. It's a block of challenge runs. Starting with tactics, I'm going to be doing the FF5 Four Job Fiesta, FF6 No Equipment Challenge, a mystery game, and ending off with Final Fantasy Tactics Solo Ramza No Calc. So um, I mostly do a lot of RPG Final Fantasy challenge runs, that sort of thing. I also, on Sundays, do a um, the BizHawk Shuffler, if you know what that is. If you don't, basically every X amount of time, you know, like, games will change. And I have 22 classic RPGs going in that, and I'm going to be starting really early tomorrow, going for hopefully about 12 hours-ish. So... Why this bomb retreated is going to be on. Now bomb, come attack. 
No? That I don't understand the bombs. Uh, what level are you? You're newly 14. Okay. If you don't want to just like come and fight me, I will make you cowardly myself. I'll do it the old-fashioned way. Storebot is okay. I'm chancy. I didn't know so. Like, so not a JRPG player, so it's all new to you. Fair enough. Um, basically, the reason I do challenge runs is um, I have played a lot of these games in my childhood slash teenage years to death, but I like them a lot still, so I just like see what kind of silly limitations I can put upon myself and still beat the game. Gotta go check out my neighbor's cat, cat sitting this weekend. Wow. Sorry, friendo. Hopefully cat sitting goes okay. What is your jump set anyway? So I can't go that way no matter what. Put you in a one hit range myself. Wow, you're attacking. That's cute. Good luck at cat seating. Uh, one of my mods, Mint, also does that fairly frequently, so... That's because I know Minotaurus can take the hits. Just wanna grind out some more XP. Little by little. Turn into bird, you know? Chuck, okay. a shame though, like no needs the EXP more than like anyone else. Yeah, no needs the EXP more than like anything else right now, so this bomb doing what I know it's about to do is a shame. Oh, cool. For once, I'm glad you didn't play. Okay, you can get up there, that's good. That's a crystal. Floating chicken! Ramza is high enough level. It's a cuckoo! Yes, yes it is. More, more to the point, it won't attack me. Low fire kill? Oh, it'll heal it though. It may be a chicken, but it is still completely... It has its elemental stuff. Okay. Nov needs EXP desperately. Out of, like, all of my other party members. Well, I attacked it, and I am still alive. Does that make me 
does that mean I win at Zelda? Forever? Well, Dove, in Tears of the Kingdom, I, there's still an embargo. Imaginary chatter who isn't real. Make up a Twitch chat. Okay. Let's take the fun route. Go all the way to Eagros Castle. And see how many fights and or eggs we get. Well, okay, I got the fight on the sphere that I wanted, but, like, that's a lot of fights to dodge in a row, not gonna lie. Okay, so Ramza does not need to act, basically, at all. Hold up. One level higher. Stats are virtually identical, though. I got a sacred in there somewhere. Nope. Realistically, I should just try for a sacred instead of grinding out Nova's level, but... You know what? There's only 12 minutes left till break time after this battle, but Nova needs to get as much EXP as humanly possible. Which means essentially no one else needs to do much of anything other than, you know, get rid of the healing chocobos and etc. Like weaken enemies in case Nope can't one shot. Oh, I didn't put Burb on the roster, that's fine. I think I actually do just want a sacred at this point, so... No, this would force Ramza to act. Okay. See the seven. This is an earth elemental, is it? Choco, choco, choco. Too bad rare candies don't exist in this game. Now the counter shouldn't kill unless it's a crit counter, and I don't think you can counter from this range anyway. A goblin enters the chocobo field. What a fool! You fool! Mickey Mouse as Goku. Hi, hello, welcome to the field, Medio. That's how Red Choke does work. I should have attacked, actually, because now the counter will kill. Peck, peck. Wham. Now you come up and heal. Like a good little chocobo. Praying for a high level sacred is like the idea. Medio. 
Okay, you didn't counter. Very good. You can outrun me, though, which I think is on. I need to heal you, though. That's like no EXP, but it is still JP, so... This might be more worthwhile. That red panther is not going anywhere, and the chocobos aren't going to get to it in time. Never mind. Oh, never, never mind. Wait. Oh. Let's get a bull range. Yes, let's get a bull range. Okay. I just want one of these goblins dead. It's funny. They're hilariously weak to ice. something am I being am I being ignored peck peck no counter okay. didn't counter very good and you're not technically in critical HP, which is even better because that makes it's gonna make the mother monsters cowardly. So yes, uh, happy Saturday time zone. I realized like yesterday that I was competing in a comeback week with SGDQ. Whoops. Um, oh no, you're gonna go heal. Dang. I, miss I I just assumed that Minotaurus would be able to get to it faster. Do this for some extra heals. You might go heal that goblin, so I want to lower your HP some more. I did not. Rem I do not remember giving you permission to turn my camera. Just don't die. Well, you're gonna. You didn't. Very good. like compatibility issues. I don't want to check your signs. I'll take these odds. I think Wave Around gives less than three. Accuracy checks! Give it up for accuracy in Final Fantasy Tactics. Give it up. That percentage is definitely not a lie in any capacity. Not at all. I don't know what you're talking about.
get countered to die, probably. You didn't even get countered. What is the point of having counter be brave percent if it fails, like, way more often than 30%? Anyway, this should be a kill. Goodbye. A million la years later, we got there in the end. Can I get to you? Yes. Honestly, as much as high level sacred would be like the actual answer. Can get there, but not in a good way. Now you can reach either way, so there's no reason for me to, like, mess around with this. Let's confirm that this does give less, though. No, it doesn't. Okay. Then I'm being silly. Then why did it give less before? Was it because I did a res and re-kill? Or was it, like, a re-kill of a thing? So instead of getting up for my first break time, I am going to run an ad break, but I'm going to spend that three minutes just trying to get a, uh, a sacred, which is basically third level Minotaur. I'm not going to bother with anything else. All of that and there was only one egg. Okay. So I am going to run three minutes of ads to kill the pre-roll. It's not going to go on break time but I am gonna try and get monsters. So it's like the one time I'm breaking my rule of not gameplay, but technically no gameplay is actually happening. So I'll see all of you on the other side. If you want to watch this exciting non-gameplay, uh, feel free to like throw money at Jeff Bezos through either subbing to my channel or with Twitch Turbo or an ad blocker, which doesn't support Jeff Bezos monetarily. No eggs in like 10 days. What a ripoff. What a duplicate. So yeah, it's the only time I'm ever gonna run ads during gameplay is when technically there's not really gameplay happening. Okay, cool, so I can get rid of this. Let's find that mini stream buff chat during ads turn volume on that. That works? I did not know that worked. A sacred is not guaranteed to be a good enough level because I have so many low level cats at this point. Your streamer ad revenue and keep watching. Twitch Turbo does count for um, ad revenue now, slash again. I got a lot of these. Any of them high level? Yep. Genuinely doesn't matter, but you have low brain. Wait, which one's the higher level? Okay, the higher level matters a little bit more to me. If I can get higher level Chlorel, I can get rid of those as well. And I can get rid of the black chocobo as well. Try and keep all of my levels nice. So, like, being subbed to my channel while I run an ad break counts as watching ads, even though you don't see ads.
Yeah. If you want to see this nice hot action of clicking a dot back and forth, um, give me money. You have higher faith. So Oh, a yellow chocobo. Dab. Three, two, one. Wow, Chad, I can't believe that happened during the ad break. Like, comment, subscribe, give me money. Okay, you're level 16. And in all honesty, you are too low level at this point, so if I get another black chocobo, you can be back up. Okay, nothing is a low enough level except for Nova, ironically enough. Which in theory I can just fix in a battle at Mandalia, but I want to try and like get a sacred anyway. Just now a sacred would actually be a decent level. Wait. Oh, vampire! Sweet, okay. Actually, I will wait for this. I will wait to rename things in case I get better stuff later. Finally got a vampire. Probably not going to use it at this point because it's no longer chapter one. Oh, another Minotauros, though. Would take work. Keeping the Minotauros around just because it's a high enough level. And I can rebuild Brave Faith, but I don't like its stat spread. Like. Well, it has a lot more HP. Despite only being like three levels higher. So I do like that. Oh, extra core. Really high faith though, 817, 815, okay. Faith is easier to lower. For the record chat, you didn't miss anything during the ad break, <laughs> I promise. It was literally this, and and then this. That was it. I really want a sacred though. Like, I feel like that's gonna help out a lot. Green dragon. I've decided I am going to recruit Mustadio, but I'm not going to necessarily commit to the side quest. I'm just going to leave them open. Red Dragon! Ooh, stats! 10, 11, 18, 9, 16. Ooh, you are good out of box. Oh, you're so tanky. Everything that was just said was perfect. Does anyone want to be a Red Dragon? Because I'm going to keep the blue dragon around. I think I can fit your full name. Do you want to be the red uh, red dragon? Let's do some naming now. I don't have um, the sacred yet, but... Lelo gets to be the edgier kitty. Bren gets to be the silver kitty because silver is your favorite color car. External screaming intensifies. Sure. Hell yeah. Is that two L's? Yes, it is. Cool. 
And if I can just get a third tier, you will be in some actual business. Higher level cockatrice would also not be bad. I normally have it as a sub perk to name self after thing in challenge run, but I kind of am not being picky right now. It's just kind of a friends can can be kind of menagerie. Okay, there's a lot of stuff happening here. No secrets. You're level 12? How are you level 12? Because you're level 12. There was a lot to unpack there. Higher level means just in general less grind, but I wouldn't have to work on the grave and fate. I'm getting really lucky, dragons just coming out naturally good. And see what monster this is. I'm just gonna level up the Minotaurus I already have. I still want a sacred for execution grounds though. The AoE, I, if I recall right, it has an AoE. Minotaurus, dragon thing. This is just a normal dragon. Okay, you're front and center. Hey, we're gone. Okay, this is some impositions for sure. Oh, you can just inflict vampire king. That might be handy for execution ground, I'm gonna be honest. That's not the worst chance I've ever seen at that. I think I might have a solution to execution ground. There you go, Burn. I kept the silver cat around because silver car are your favorite, right? Ooh, you're way too squishy. You won't counter. Pout. Valid pout. Teaching this cat about Reddit is going to be difficult, I feel like. Okay, Choco Cure heals a decent amount. It just requires them to be kind of glued at the hip. That is such a low chance. Oh, 
other person makes this final, huh? That low brave isn't ideal, though. Let's see the animation. That's a cool animation. Hi there, you're in medio range. Goodbye. <laughs> Fire! Breathe, fire, melt that rock. Okay. Thunder Breath default for the Fire Dragon because reasons. Yeah, I very much want a sacred. Also breathe fire. Actually, a kill would be wasted on me at this point. <laughs> Bye. Easy game, easy life, yeah. That was a 33%. I'm not gonna hit those in the execution. There's gonna be a lot of resets in execution side because I need a lot of luck based things to work. Scratching post. One brave. Rams is over leveled, so no can play catch up this way. And be like, okay. Solid encounter. Yes. I didn't expect it to hit twice. Not the most EXP, honestly, I kind of want to just take it though, but at the same time... Yeah, I want a sacred. By the way, if you're not already in the Discord, uh, if you want to know exactly when I go live with opt-in ping rolls, 
Also, community nights, hangouts, uh, coming soon again, co-commentary recordings at some point. There is a link to the Discord. Feel free to just come hang out whenever. Yeah, you know what? As m you're a higher level, but like the, the Brave Faith work will take way too much. Coincidentally, if I get a vampire with higher Brave... Go to the new year! Let's make it a flat to the new year. Merry Christmas! Happy New Year! This is how time feels like it goes sometimes. Okay, first, oh, there's a lot to unpack here. No. No. Level 16, so yeah. No. And then, yes, you can stay. I should be poaching those off, but I'm not gonna. Getting a sacred is a lot. For something I could have had in chapter one, I sure don't have it yet. Bomb Gaming! Uh, thank you so much for the raid. Friends of the Red Mage Village, we are once again under attack. Welcome to everybody from D-Bomb's stream. Let me give you one of these. My name is Dove, pronouns are they, she. I am a retro RPG challenge run enthusiast, mostly streaming classic Final Fantasy challenge runs. I am, however, a red mage in the truest sense of the word. I do a little bit of everything, including shufflers, randomizers, and if I'm feeling fancy, I'll take some CPUs, lock them in a basement, force them to play Monopoly. If that floats your boat, Feel free to hit the follow button, stick around sometime. What were you up to tonight, D-Bomb? I hope you had a good stream. Friends on my end, D-Bomb Gaming is a friend of the stream. Go check out ETC. I hope you had a good stream. Right now, I am working on a challenge run for Final Fantasy Tactics. How you doing, D-Bomb? Thank you again for the raid. I appreciate it. Life insurance for every raid bomb that happens. No, I'm just like really good at fighting. Yeah, it's so Thank you for the follow, I appreciate it. I have anonymous follows on, so if people need to raid and run, take care of themselves. Or, if you feel so inclined, feel free to speak up and chat, but no obligation. Uh, right now, I am trying to get a very specific breed of monster. Rules are up there on the right, or exclamation mark challenge if you would like a like an exhaustive list. But, basically, I can only have monsters in my party. Ramza must be a mediator at all times, and I am banning uh, overpowered abilities. Great stream, matter of fact, getting close to the end of Dragon Warrior Alchemy. Nice. I've never heard of that. Is that actually tied to the Dragon Quest series? Higher, but lower stats. That really matters. Wild bows, I need to keep dupes up specifically. Uh, 
Gonna match up with the first four games done in RPG Maker. Oh! I need to check that out. Is that just like an itch.io project or is that on Steam? Or is that just like, you know, back alley website video game link? Dot edu. I need to check that out, actually. Because, funny you mentioned Dragon Quest, like early Dragon Quest. Dragon Quest 3 is in my uh, BizHawk Shuffler. On Sundays, I do. I am doing a 22 game BizHawk Shuffler with a bunch of RPGs, and Dragon Quest 3 is in that, actually. Absolutely. Uh, feel free to do exactly that. That would be that would be lovely actually. I would love to check that out. Okay, let's go, let's go nuts chat. Let's go a full calendar month to April. I'm gonna again call this grind sesh at June and just progress the plot. Monster my farming for a uh, third level of Minotaur, known as a sacred. You are less of an investment, so it's over there. Daddy O, what is up, Hilo? Shuffler has been fun to watch, thank you. Shuffler has been fun to play, and I'm gonna be doing it a lot tomorrow. Sundays are gonna be longer streams. Um Sundays are longer streams. It's a 22 game shuffler. Uh, the games were added through a... Like, back in March, I did a donation incentive thing for charity. I did a donation stream. And basically, every donation incentive that was met, I added a game to the shuffler via wheel spin. Higher level. So that's why there are 22 games. The condition was I have to beat every game in the shuffler. So uh, every Sunday, I'm going to be doing probably close to an 8 to 10 hour stream, you know, conditions allowing, like if my internet allows, where um, I just do BizHawk Shuffler, like all day. But primarily, I do challenge runs. I once again primarily do challenge runs. Yeah, I'm gonna give it till June. I'll give it till June 1st in game. And that's when I'll go back to do plot. Why is Arm Sacreds in the main game post them for Holy Lands? Yeah, oh I'm I'm doing them to use them at this point. Oh hello. Okay, you're exact opposite of what I need, even though you're a higher level. Uh, you're, you're green. I need experienced battlefield. And yeah, you're a low level. 914, 916. Ooh, I almost went <laughs> up into a random battlefield. I can do this again after Galg, but like... These spots are really close together, whereas the two spots I'm going to have to do that with after Gaug are really small. I have a bunch of eggs. Ooh, okay. I'd have to work on your brave, but your faith is about where I want it, and you're a higher level. Okay, when did I last in game save? Back in January. Back in January, seven minutes ago. I can see what one of the monsters is. If it's a sacred, that'd be great. Can 
thing doesn't look like. Okay. I need to rename everything too. I should have done that beforehand. Oh, that's what it was. The first day cash was that. Okay. I was about to say, I didn't get rid of my cockatrice, did I? <laughs> By accident? That would, have, that would suck. This week has also been the inaugural week for the Red Mage Village Summer Festival Block of Challenge runs going from now until they're done. I'm just like quantifying and, and giving name and, and purpose bid to, you know, for strife and adventure. I'm just naming my blocks. Oh, I forgot to bring Ramza entirely, but that's fine. I just don't really have healing then, but that's fine. I need to rename all of my monsters too. Luckily, this is a really easy formation. Panthers are a little bit more scary than the goblins, but only just so. Oh no, anyway. Pack, pack. He's a goblin. It'd be funny. Stop, hell yeah. Stop means you can't block this. So I'm just gonna have to take the risk. Although the bird needs the XP a lot more now, but details. Pounch. A whap. Oh, that's unfortunate. For you. Yeah, you wanna keep in the shape. Yeah, you're fine. It's the bird that needs the EXP the most. Kick, 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 kick.
Go, go, Meteo! Yeah. Yeah, you're no longer, like, desperate for your XP, it's, it's the bird. Feather bomb kills at that range. Not that it needs to, but hey. My monsters are a good enough level. I don't think I'm taking the bird into the execution site anyway, so this actually works out. Now, if I can just get a sacred, that would be ideal, but. Just move into the goblin, consume it. I should have gone for either steal or break weapon beforehand, but then I wouldn't have items. So. Okay. I need to rename all of my stuff. And get rid of normal chocobo. Consecutive normal chocobo. Quality eggs. The silver car. E. Why is the random pig called E? I don't know. And then, like, in a few years, we're gonna find out that, like, you get a bunch of specific species of monsters in very specific configurations and, like, name them in very specific ways and it wrong warps or something. And then dies the black chocobo. I'm interested in just ending this quickly. In the interest of just ending this one quickly. My levels should be fine. Once again, the archer up top there, bombs over there, birds over there. This time there are three bombs and two birds. How fancy. Before I do this again, I'll take a hot shot. Okay, you can't reach me. So I'll be able to hit and run probably. Also, it's raining, like, super heavy in, in here, so Thunder Breath should actually be, like, really good. Bomba! This is going to be a better camera angle for me. Please understand. I want 
dragon. Lower faith. Reddit.com. Well, dragon ouchie. Yeah. So I'm just gonna let the bombs chase me. It's fine. You are now ouchie. Even with the added effect, it wasn't enough to kill. It's still gonna be a while, so I'm just gonna huddle near you. An ouchie. Get X Berba. Thunder bracelet. Yeah, that's right, enemy team. You're not the only one with zappy power. Anyway, bye. Attacking the dragon. Okay, your faith is pretty low. Reddit.com.
Ooh, wow. Almost out. No counter, though. 70%, by the way. Wave around. Sad bomb. Ow. What's the turn list? Okay, Barb can only get one of them before the other explodes. I can only get one of them this time, and that's fine. Probably only get one. Well, assuming I counter. R slash atheism. Goodbye. Okay. I was hoping that wouldn't happen so that Brave could get even more X, but. Did you learn anything useful? Or can you a lot? Would come in handy for the farms and nothing else. This is about as good as I'm gonna get for execution side. I still have to get through Galg, so I'm like putting the cart way before the horse. But. Okay, I want one rubber shoes, just in case. One of these. Too. You're going silent because car hunting can be exhausting. We found one maybe looking into on Wednesday. Okay. Hopefully it goes well. I'd rather not, actually. I'm, I'm okay with my levels. And this is a really awkward spot for most of my monsters to fight in. So I'll do Galg and then take a proper break. It'll still be an ad break, but this time I won't be sitting at my computer at it. I do believe I've already been live for like two hours.
Okay, we start with a cutscene and I'm able to shop here, but I don't think they have a lot in the way of equipment, so it's after Galga can buy stuff. Thankfully, this is not a Protect Mustadio battle, so I don't have to worry too much. So it's a silver 2015.5 Chevrolet, where its quality of life feature is that it's silver. Am I am I understanding the the compromise car correctly? Okay, I have like no equipment. I guess, I guess we can just leave and- Oh, no! Anyway. This is just a kill them all kind of experience. Rams's position doesn't matter. A lot of these have steel as secondary, and there are two thieves, three thieves, I think. So it's, yeah, it's two thieves, two archers, who can have steel as secondary, and two summoners. My low faith makes the summoners not so bad. Put him in there. Gleam. Apologies for my quietness today too. My throat is just kind of like feeling very weird. The coffee didn't hurt it but I've been feeling kind of weird in my throat for the last like two or three days. Mustadio, do a punch! Mustadio, do a punch! Yeah, go to study. Proceed. How bad are you? Nothing. Nothing. It's only for me. 
Car hunting can be exhausting, yeah. Shot. Sleep on either of those would have been really good. Don't need to see all of you, I only need to see me. percent chance to hit 90 percent chance to hit definitely just bad luck of observational bias definitely nothing shady going on there and of course you hit a 67 i miss a 90 computer hits a 67 absolutely just how it goes yep definitely just how it goes Unfortunate, really. Game doesn't cheat, though. To be fair, the game doesn't cheat. It just feels like it a vast majority of the time. Okay. Bap, bap. That was a decision we made. Fred needs to be XP. chances here. None, apparently. Not do you're not dodging a 90 twice. Caution, huh? Not a chance in hell, but... Oh, okay. Nice. 
No, you're gonna pick on the Minotaur. Okay. That's a charge and it's only gonna do 20? Okay. These are charges. I want to look into your eyes, point blank range, and honest to god, watch this ranged attack just kill you. Goodbye. Those are charges. Charges. Kind of hurt. Enough anyway. This battle could have gone worse. I only had to deal with Steelheart once, and I had some bad luck. But the archers not having it was actually kind of huge. Um, summoner deciding to punch me, the other one dying in one hit was also big. Like, this battle can sometimes be, uh, really annoying, but it wasn't this time. That's cute. So anyway, reddit, um, uh, reddit.com. Oh, I'm silenced? When did that happen? Okay. Lady, you've ever been scratched up by a bird before? Would you like to? The downside to keeping Mustadio, I realize, is I'll always have a level 12 person in my party, which means monsters will like always be between 12 and where I'm at. So truth be told, I think I actually don't take Mustadio. It means missing a lot of side quests, but let's be honest, I wasn't doing them anyway because I'm killing time till the four job fiesta, so. So I'm going to take him and make a backup save. But he's only level 12, so I am going to release him. I'm just like, you know, if I change my mind kind of thing. It would re mean replaying the game again at this point, but, like, cheats are a thing, so I really don't care. Are we 
gonna make a backup save here. Release Moustadio. Just because, like, level discrepancy is a thing. So when a monster hatches, it can be anywhere from your lowest level to your highest level. Okay. So I'm going to take an actual break here. I am still, once again, going to run three minutes of ads just to kill pre-roll for an hour. So, um, feel free to get up, get something to eat, drink, stay hydrated, stretch your legs. Don't go too far, though. I will be right back.
<clears throat> All right, I am back. Hi, hello. Oh, that actually helped. Okay, good to know. Yeah, I, I took a cough drop because, like, I really, um... My throat is, like, kind of sore today. It, hey, I want to do, like, uh, 12 hours tomorrow, by the way. Let's get back to it. So first off, cutscene. But like, yeah, my, my throat is like kind of sore. So I took a cough drop. It actually kind of helped, at least in terms of I'm able to talk. So that's pretty cool. Um, I really hope I'm not getting COVID again. That would suck. But anyway, yeah, cutscene. I can't return to um, the north half of the map until I've beaten the execution site, which is like two battles away. Anyway, hi, Delita. Bye, Delita. I'll see you again if we live that long. Wow, what a confidence. Now I can outfit myself better. I'm gonna buy a lot of those. Um, can I buy anything else of worth here? Not really. It's PA plus one. I'm not worried about that. I wanna back up one or two of those too, because it's gonna help with uh, things later. Okay, I cannot buy X potions yet. That's fine. Yeah, green berets are very, very, very important because they give speed. <coughs> I'll have five extra. Will I need that many? No. But it's time to go to a valley. Who's ready to recruit and immediately dismiss Agrius? Well, I'm not because the game is a cutscene. Alright, this is where Draclaw kills Bart. I'm more reliable than him. Failed me for the last time, Admiral. Okay, he's ready for the valley. Let's go play in the valley. We're sick of this crapped old city. Let's play in the valley. So it's another squad battle. Mm 
wild camera action zoom spin. You hear the run up, but the units just like kind of appear because Chocobo was there in the top corner, just up here. Agrius is not allowed to die, and it's extremely rare, but sometimes that can just happen. Sometimes, once in a great while, Agrius can just die before you get a turn, and there's nothing you can do. So the whole squad thing, yeah, I'm not doing that. We're, we're all on this side. Everyone over on that side can just hack it. Somehow, I don't know, let's try stabbing them. It's worked so far. Nice. If I'd been more proactive, that black mage would be dead. Actually. Low chance to hit, but assume it hits. That's nice. Don't care. Didn't ask. Plus L. Plus ratio. You're going to break something. You know that would be hilarious if that moved out of the way for the archer. Donald Duck! Like, I can literally see just fine here. I figured that would be bait. Yeah, that's not a lot of damage, though. Oh. Well... I mean... I don't like that you moved my camera without permission to do that. Again, as I said, camera's fine where it is, thank. You're really tanky, you can move up. Bomba! Hey, Miss Renders, thank you. To the current of life we succumb. It's judgment swift and final. It's bite as cold as steel. That's the line, Agrius. If you're gonna if you're gonna be in this, you have to actually get the script right, just saying. No peck peck. I mean 70% means 20 anyway, so it's fine. Camera's fine, Redis, thank you. Oh, it's gonna be a long time and it's fire, not bolt, so we're fine. That's cute.
I thought you lived out right though. Thunder bracelet. No more haste. Oh, lightning staff. Ooh, I wish you were like. Mm, I should have kept Mustadia around just for this battle. Just have both. That was a really good Agrius start. That's nice. Tomorrow is going to be a hopefully long stream with um, the return of the Bizhog Shuffler. Yeah, that depth change is going to be way too much, but I'm going to go here anyway. The lower I can push my face, the better. Long range meteor, long range meteor. Hearts of men are black with corruption, must needs be cleansed. Searches to believe this challenge is going more or less. How you doing, Liz? 
I hope you're doing well. I hope you are having one of the Saturday time zones of all time. I mean, I'll grind here, that's fine. I got no qualms. That may not have been a wise decision to make. Catch this bullet! It's going Saturday, like, for whatever that implies. Very nice. Anyway. Taking your diamond armlet, otherwise, meh. I've already dismissed Mustadio, so there's no reason to go over a backup save here, even though starting with lightning stab is very ideal. It's also rather rare. Like, really, did you start? Yeah, yeah, you started with that. Defend is meh. Oh, never mind, you didn't start with that. Like, this is such a good Agrius. It's such a shame. You are, you are unfortunately human, Agrius, so my bad. Okay, chat. It is time. Expect resets. Expect me to say the word dialogue in a very long and drawn out manner. Expect a mild modicum of salt. This is one of what I like to call the big five. Missions that are in such a way that I consider them actually difficult basically in any run. Hi, Drake! I can do that. Okay, how do I want to play this? We'll try it this way first. Basically, I'm relying a lot on status elements hitting. <coughs> so for anyone who's familiar with tactics, you recognize this battle map and this cutscene very vividly. Especially challenge runners. This is one of the hardest battles in the game. Full stop. This is a kill them all mission despite this being a perfect setup for a boss mission. Gavgarian is equipped with a blood sword so he heals on hit. He also has his Night Sword attack, which drains on hit. There's also a lot of in-battle dialogue. Th this game loves doing this. Hey, this battle's like really difficult. Let's let's make it even more tedious with dialogue. Of course, you go for bear first. Naturally, we start with a crit. There is a huge temptation to reset right now. Okay. 
I'm going to reset. Starting with a crit is no. Just like I start with a crit and you level up. I'm sorry, no. It did tell me that my formation was like kind of wrong. I don't want the bird there. I want to lure the bug. Uh, I want to lure Gafgarian out, not towards the back. Any statuses I can inflict, especially Petrify, will be huge. Any statuses I can inflict here are going to be actually gargantuan. to take it got hurt so many times in memes now yeah so I consider this game as a whole when you know the job system really well and everything I consider it a relatively easy game casually speaking this is not a difficult game if you know what jobs to go for what is what's good what's not know the battles but even in a casual playthrough there are five battles I can actually consider to put up a fight this is one of them uh, Viagraph Bellius in um, Rio Veins is also up there. Bulk 2 is up there. I consider that the hardest battle in the entire game outright. Like, there are so many battles that I um, consider difficult. Well, there's not so many, but like the ones that are, are very infamous. This, in all, in my opinion, should have been a beat Gafgarian battle, not a kill the wall. So I think I want Bird and Minotauros here, or Bird and Dragon here. Nice! That helps. a line of sight thing. Worth a shot. on my side. This is damage, which is nice. That might be okay, too. 
Slow and Demi. Okay. I can revive the bird, that's fine, if this goes bad. You're gonna just take the free shot right now. I mean, you're dead anyway, so... strong night, but I did turn a knight against him. to revive the bird in a bit. Take care of these guys first.
Yeah, I think I want to try and revive the bird now. It'll be slim picking for the archer, though, but that's whatever. Ball! Temporarily melt the chocobo. Gavgarian kills the bird here. That's that's whatever. Does put Gavgarian in a better range. You did Oh, you're you're my guy. Why are you over here? You have enemies to fight over there. You hadn't moved there. I have to take this coin flip. Yes, sir. Uh... Occupied as much as possible. Because so I can do this all day. That Guardian takes the free hit and runs. Eventually, it's only going to be Gavgarian, though, so it's whatever. Yeah, goodbye. Take the chance! Honestly, I'm okay with this loop because it keeps Gavgarian from doing anything unpredictable. Slow, that's annoying. I have to assume it hits both. That, that does make this kind of annoying. Like, the Time Mage isn't gonna live long enough to regret it, and the Vampire's done its job. That's what I didn't want. I mean, you die for it, but, you know.
too! I don't care about get ability at this point. Take the easy shot and run. Because a predictable AI is predictable. Predictable AI is predictable. Yeah, I decided you don't get to live. Removing the elements of predictability here, but... Nice, slow did not last very long. Ramza, huh? That's interesting. Auto it would have been interesting if Auto Potion worked. Now you cannot turn chicken, but... Yeah, nothing I really do is gonna help either. Lamau. You can wake him up if you want, that's fine. Aww, that would've been sweet. Sleeping people are immune to this, I think. I got stop off. Hell yeah. Okay. This could have gone worse. This could have gone way worse. Goodbye, Gavgari, in part one. Honestly, that could have gone way worse, and now I know to keep the vampire around for status effects like that, because, like, getting an invitation and a petrify and a stop was huge. Honestly, Bird was just there as bait. I was expecting to like petrify more people, that was the plan. Otherwise I would have had the dragon instead, but like this worked out because Gafgarian stayed predictable the whole time. I got a petrify off, I got an invite off. Like the amount of stuff I was able to pull off in that battle. Like, damn. I'll take a smooth execution site though. I will always, always take a smooth execution site. Dude's name is Dog, he's trying to pass himself off as a monster. He's trying, but unfortunately for him I have eyes, so...
the mid-game plot twist music. Princess Ovelia, in name only, for she is neither. Oh, I have an egg key. Hi, dog. Nice clothes change, anyway. Bye. Yep. You killed your friends for nothing. I'd rather not, actually. I will very much take a smooth execution grounds though. That that battle can go like a number of ways. That battle can definitely go some ways. Okay, that's what I thought. Oh now two inkies. Okay, Lionel Castle Part 1. And actually, I forgot to equip Telepo like I wanted. That was the whole reason I grinded out Time Mage to learn Teleport in the first place was to get outside the gate. Okay, my package came in. That's really good. Okay, Ramza. I don't need to change your equipment, although giving you a diamond armlet is probably good, too. Okay, yeah, um, Lionel Castle Part 1. For real this time. And then I need to put on a defense armlet and um, move plus one again afterwards. Okay, so I need hard hitting this time. I need no... And Aurelia. Either other monster is a lot of risk. Wait there, monsters, I'll open the gate.
Cap Guardian can wait a hot minute. Can I get an auto potion? Yeah. Is methodically. Let's do this methodically. That's bait. Oh no, this is going to be better for Ramza to rose the bird lady. Six. Let's go damage them. Not quite enough, damn it! No! I knew that would do that. Don't level up, you're gonna fucking die. Still hit rounds up in there, Lamau. <clears throat> okay. A lot of these really good auto potion procs. Really, really good. It's not gonna hit, but I'm gonna go anyway. Abram Eden! Abram Eden, thank you so much for the raid! Friends of the Red Mage Village, we are under attack. Welcome in everybody from Avery Mean Stream. My name is Dove, pronouns they, she. I am a retro RPG challenge run enthusiast, mostly streaming classic Final Fantasy challenge runs. However, I am also a red mage in the truest sense of the word. I do a little bit of everything. 
I'll do some shufflers, randos, sometimes rando shufflers. If I'm feeling fancy, I'll lock some CPUs in a basement and force them to play Monopoly. If that floats your boat, feel free to hit the follow button. I have anonymous follows on, so if you just want to lurk or if you need to raid and run, that is absolutely positively acceptable and okay. What were you up to today, bud? Evermeaden is an old friend of mine. I actually met in Final Fantasy XIV, and um, we did the Ivalice raids at, at one point. So, you know, rather fun coincidence that. So go give a follow to Abram Eden as well. What were you up to? I hope you had a great stream. P9 through P12. Nice. Nice. No story spoilers, of course, but I hope you had fun. Um, now let's go back to here. Right now I am doing the Final Fantasy Tactics Monster Party Challenge. Rules are up there on the right, or exclamation mark challenge if you want a readable list of rules. Basically, I can have monsters, and that's it. Rom's has to be a mediator, but anything else goes. This calls for an expression. I'll go res the burden a bit, but I just need to make sure that Dragon also doesn't die. It's a lot to come back from. And we are about to wrap, start wrapping up chapter two. It was good. I'm glad to hear it. I... I poked into P9S as a healer. Uh, it was interesting. I'm gonna go for a break right here. I hate you so much. Give it up for Armor Break, everyone! Armor Break is a very fun and useful ability. Totally fair and balanced ability. Absolutely joy to see every single run. Definitely not annoying to fight against. Not at all. I have a soundboard, by the way, for anyone new. Um, yeah, this is the start of what I like to call the Red Mage Village Summer Festival, a block of challenge runs. There's this one, Final Fantasy V Forge Job Fiesta, of course, FF6, no equipment, a mystery game, and a second tactics run to end it off way later. Um, there's also a sub goal incentive for Final Fantasy IV Solo Cecil. Each sub will add one to the counter. If I hit that, the, the sub goals for the entire festival, so for this and the next, like, bunch of runs. If you want to see the suffering that is Solo Cecil, well, there's an opportunity. If Garian's mad, so he's just gonna, like, sit and pout in his castle, his timeout castle. Ramza, Ramza can very hint. Wait, no. One, two, three. It'll take two turns. If Ramza doesn't act, we're fine. Ramza being a target is good, though. Because of that. Seventy-seven versus ninety-five. There you go. Okay, so on paper, this is, this battle's not going poorly. We're in good shape. Monsters can be busted in FFT. They can be. So human units are better as a general rule. Okay, no auto potion is scary, but that's fine. Um, but, like, monsters are really, really, really strong. Human units are better because they can have, like, extra abilities, they can heal, that sort of thing. Just gonna do this. We're gonna play it super safe. They have higher versatility. Uh, human units can have support abilities, secondary abilities, use things like items. They have better healing options, better defensive options. Monsters can be busted, though, in the right circumstance. I just need to reset the counter. I don't need Bird actually alive right now. That said, gonna go for Bird. Oh, cool. I can do this. Pets are fine. For the shot.
I need to get Ramza to open the gate. So why I'm not having the chocobo move, I don't need to. Oh, you're gonna heal! Counter! Damn. Technically, you countered. You look at that, you're up to full health! You did it! Congratulations, you're at full health! How does it feel? It must be amazing to be back at full health, full strength, full capacity. Good for you, real proud of you. I should have just thrown a high potion at bird. So yeah, you should um you should follow me. RNG is absolutely not my friend. It hasn't been. Like I've had some pretty bad luck, but the last battle went incredibly well, so I've also had some good luck. Hi, that wasn't smart of you. Will that kill? No. You're not getting up that time. Okay. Thank you for the follow. I appreciate it. As I mentioned, I have anonymous follows on, so feel free to lurk to your heart's content. That said, if you would like to speak up in chat, that is also welcome. Both are very valid options. Red Chocobo does not have Choco Cure naturally, but standing next to someone with monster skill gives monsters an extra ability. This is all, like, not good ideas for you. That's nice. So this is like kind of a lot more on the chill side compared to challenge runs I normally do. And the reason for that is um, like I'm, I thought the Forge Up Fiesta was gonna start sooner. And because it didn't, I just kind of like wanted to give myself something to do in the time, so. You just have charge, you have nice, brave, nice, brave. Ooh, I kind of don't want to mess with that actually. Okay, Archer, join my party for free. Oh, uh, sure. No. All right, then. So, like, I'm having, like, the weirdest luck as it is, but yeah. You gonna start approaching me now? No? I'm just like, gonna get in position and heal a bunch. Are you going to take the box? You can't. Good. Let's take that 80%. Yeah. If Guy in his final one was realizing how much his banner is important, yeah. Before you die, Gafgarian, I want you to know they betrayed you. Every single one of them. Not one of them was loyal to you. 
They all beg to join me in their final moments. Just, just letting you know this, Gafgarian. Just as you were not loyal to Diasadark or the church, they were not loyal to you. You, you absolute mercenary. Let's go ahead and tell myself about Reddit real quick. That's not gonna do anything for this battle, but it'll help later. I just want to make sure everybody is nice and topped off before I do this. I want to make sure Gaff is also approaching me first. Okay, you're not. Uh, the archer's name... Rat. So we had a dog before. I would then not be able to get out. could do that. Use the bird as bait. That isn't your spot, rat. They're trying to be undercover monsters, I guess. I, I guess. Maybe that's why they joined my party, because they knew. Okay, I'm not even close. Teleport fail. That's fine. Oh, my God, I could... No? Oh, okay. Oh, you're not approaching me. Instead of coming right to me, you're running away. The old guy shrugging is all you feel, yeah. Throw wide the gates! Go, go, go! Howdy. <laughs> Rut row. Oh, that didn't. Okay. Roms and the gang rolls up, yeah. I didn't auto potion, but that's okay because I can do this instead. Just normal potion. I should have just waved around. Me and my monsters and this soldier of yours I picked up. I don't get to fire breath very often. Yeah, fire. <laughs> I got killed by your own guy, Gafgarian. Goodbye, Gafgarian.
It's been real, bud. I normally don't make a habit of saving over a spot like this, but... It'll be fine. Trust. Okay, first off, I'd like that back. I was about to say, where's Rat? Yeah. Thanks for killing Gafgarian. Bye. Teleport no longer matters. It was literally that battle was the only reason I wanted it for exactly the reason I wanted it there. I knew I wasn't going to be able to 1v1 Gafgarian safely. Auto Potion is not reliable enough with only 73 Brave. Um. So. Yeah, Auto Potion is just the opposite of reliable. I didn't want to, um. Like, go in with that. So I wanted to teleport out to be with the squad so that, like, Red Chocobo can heal AoE and that Ramza can res and heal. Uh, otherwise, that battle would have been big fight material. So, in the meantime... I mean, with the old guy struggling is all you feel, yeah. Okay, the spread kind of matters for the sake of, um, like, speed reasons. Oh, I forgot to put the defense thing on, that's fine. I'm hoping for... Actually, it doesn't matter, as long as, like, not everybody's asleep, we're okay. We might have to watch the cutscene a few times. It's gonna be RNG. I just need Kuhalin to not run. He needs to... If he gets in range of Nov, that's basically the end of it. Even if you are a bastard. That's not a nice thing to say. Well, no, no. You were born from a low-born mother, out of wedlock. You are, by definition, Ramsa Beov, a bastard child. Oh, I, I thought we were just, like, der deriding my progress against your schemes. Oh, that too! I realize I have a good Ramza voice. Anyway, Kuhala needs to come down and realistically not hit for How loud can I scream? Not loud enough for my gods to hear me. Okay, everyone needs to go back row. Yeah, everyone needs to go back row. Okay, not ideal. Ramza turns. <laughs> Ramza turns while I'm running around the <laughs> field screaming, yeah. He's not on Uber Spire right now, but yeah, that's more or less how this game goes when you stay in Uber Spire. It's supposed to be Ku Helen, the translation. Yes! In the PSP version, he's Ku Helen. Okay. You're way too far for me to hit you reasonably, so no.
God, I have a lot of equipping to do. I really hope you don't force like a lot of resets due to luck. Because I have to de-equip you. Remove you. Receive and turn you. And then change abilities out. I could drop a save state, but that doesn't feel right. Ramza's position officially doesn't matter. Like, Bellius, uh, with a B, is actually Velius with a V in this one, in the PSX translation. Adramelic is Adramelk, which is cursed. Um, Hashmal, Hashmal is Hashmalum, I think. Or vice versa, I forget. Um, Ultima is Ultima with an A. Zalara is unchanged. Is like, come down here and do a punch. That would be the most ideal. You won't, but that would be ideal. It's okay. It's not great. Okay. That's not ideal, but this is okay. It's workable. You can't come down. That wasn't smart of me. shot but still it's
might be game. Yep, had a feeling. I don't need to last long, just long enough. Plays Wilhelm, Scream does not elaborate, runs ad break. <laughs> Finish chapter two. So yeah, if Tetra lives, Delita's not here at this point in the game, and Goltana has less paranoia being crept into his ear. Whoever the church would send in Delita's place would probably not be skilled enough to pull this off. Especially around TG Sid. Delita has a <laughs> I'm screaming in for every moment, yeah. Delita has a certain charisma about him and an ability to just completely, just deadpan bluff. Like, almost some Mike Airman Trout from Breaking Bad levels of just confidently be in places you're not supposed to be and just do a lot of social engineering. The church doesn't have anyone else capable like Delita to do this. I guarantee that they don't. So if teacher lives, Delita either helps recover or just like, goes after Dysodark for revenge. Delita's not here. Goltana does not start getting all Macbethy about it. And TG Sid probably shuts down any attempts the church has and possibly sees through it enough to convince Goltana, hey, maybe back off of this war because it's not about the succession. The church is playing you. Why TG Sid didn't try that in the first place is a little beyond me, actually. Because someone as seasoned and experienced in terms of warfare would probably recognize this play, but Delita is just really that good at, like, just ascending ranks. At this point in the game, if we were to explore the what if Dice Dark dies in chapter one, what if? Well, Gol Goltana sweep. Goltana sweep, honestly, because Delita is still here. Like, Delita still joins with Goltana. Dice Dark's already dead, so there's only Zalbag to get revenge on. Zalbag is. Not as malleable because he's less in the know than Dice Dark was. And being less in the know means that when push comes to shove, maybe Larg survives the, the poisoning that the church throws out at that battlefield. But maybe that battle doesn't even take place because the battle is kind of one-sided with Goltana, with Delita, and Orlando taking on basically just Zalbag. Then you add, like, Wyagraph to the mix, and the Northern Lion's chances of winning drastic go down. See, the three-way at Fort Basila.
Anyway, this, there's going to be a lot of grinding in early chapter 3 because I need some specific abilities from Thief of all things. Move plus 2 being one of them. But also stealing stuff would be handy. Do I really need steel weapon though? I would have needed it in chapter 2. Because Biograph has maintenance, so realistically. I need Equip Sword from Knight. Or Martial Arts. I'm, I'm more or less planning for Wyagrath Valius, and that's not going to be an exciting fight because I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to cheese. First thing to do about it is save. Because that was like a lot of cutscene in a row. Second off is to equip. Also, first shop. That's the place where, you know, you're poached monsters. I need to learn poach this chapter as well. It was Brigadine, really? The strongest? Okay. Technically got an upgrade then. Um, I don't need any of those. Having one of these couldn't hurt. A couple of these would be nice. That couldn't hurt. That couldn't hurt. Can I buy X potions yet? Yes, how many? 70. I'll keep high potions around for grinding reasons. stuff back. Okay. Do I want to buy any more X potions? Not really. You know, I can't get to a 99. Not that I need 99, but yeah. Alternatively, I don't need to save high potions for grind. Because I'll be making more money than God anyway. So having all these X potions is okay. I know I need to buy heavy armor for Ramza going down night and whatnot, but yeah. I have three eggs. Okay, but none of them are a sacred. So, what do I need this chapter specifically? Move plus two would be nice. Summoner. I don't need anything else from Time Mage. Speed save would be nice, but as soon as I have Thief, I'm done with Archer. And that's like, I don't know, a thing.
From Thief, I need move plus two. Do I need anything else from Chemist? Remedies wouldn't be bad at this point. Holy Water wouldn't be bad either for Chapter 4. Yeah, I'm not going to need Holy Water this chapter. Remedy, though, would be nice. Uh, anything new from Uber Squire? No, but I do want to accumulate before the chapter ends. So I need one round of Squire, one of Archer, a little bit of Chemist, and a lot of Thief. Monster-wise, I don't think I can get a single new monster. That would be, like, any use. I don't think I can get Hydra Hydra yet. I don't think I can get, um... Behemoths yet. If this were War of the Lions version, I'd be able to get a Behemoth. Like, by force, but yes. Um, hmm. Okay. So next week is probably gonna be a lot of... Like, all of Thursday might be the grind, if I'm being honest. Oh, what hatched, if any? None, but I have a fourth egg. I do need to grind stuff out, but I haven't switched jobs yet, so... So, yeah. I might need to take an ad break here soon anyway to get, like, another cough drop. My throat is a little sore, and I'm going to be going, like, all day tomorrow, so... Like, for the shuffler. Now loading. Now loading. Now loading. One hatched first. Bull demon, but not so good. And three cracked eggs. Okay. What else is new? Another red chocobo. Taya from Yu-Gi-Oh! 916, 1116. Nope. That Brave Faith spread is really, really, really good, but no. Oh, right. I want to get, like, all the monsters up to at least 80, 85 Brave. And Rom's up to 97. But also, I want a Sacred, so we're going to try that, too. All honesty, I might not even take an ad break. Like, barring a last second raid, I might actually just call it a little early so I can rest my voice for tomorrow. Um, I think I'm gonna do that. So, barring like the last secondest of last second raids. Um, sorry for the short one, but I did do a long one yesterday as a bonus, so that's pretty neat. Um, I'm gonna go look for someone to ho 